Hi, I'm Carlin Adelson. I am 26 and I recently retired from dating. If I could do anything, I would just fast forward eight months to the spooning phase where everything is takeout Indian, DVR, ditching your friends to cuddle. I hate the word cuddle. So I am holding auditions for the long-term position of Big Spoon. This is Cuddling with Carlin, the Big Spoon search. Seriously, guys, I, I hate the word cuddle. What, what do I do? I lay down? Have you ever spooned before? We'll find out. I, I don't know. Some, some people have different definitions of spoon. I'm concerned, but you're going to get on this side okay. of the bed, and together, you're going to go this way, because this is a bed, so you lie in beds this way. Okay, so you want me on this side. You're going to get on this side, so and then your like feet are going to swing ass, around. Ass to mouth? No. no. How's this? You're... I mean, you don't have to hold the pillow anymore. Okay. <laughs> And where am I, where are like the eye lines and all that? Nowhere, who cares? Any, Cause there are can, a lot of cameras in here. Like this way? Like this like way? Your, your face angled like... This way, like out. Is this better? This is shitty? <laughs> I'm neurotic. I'm a neurotic Jewish guy in New York and this is, that's how neurotic Jewish guys in New York get into bed. Do I go I here? Where do I put my feet? I it's the temperature, bad. okay. Actually, when I was in ninth grade, Yeah. Um, I was still like, I transferred schools and uh -huh. I was kind of a late bloomer. So I was like growing into my body a little bit, but awkwardly. And so uh, ass and no titties. Right. Mm -hmm. Right. Exactly. Okay. Thank you. Thank you for making that overt. This is my favorite Russian law firm. And by Russian I law firm, I mean, I'm Russian and I'm also firm. <laughs> this is awful. But Lucas with a K is very Germanic too. It is. So you're, you're very are... Luke, Lucas Kaiser. Yeah. I don't know what that accent was. Lucas Kaiser. Lu Lucas. It's a Dutch guy talking German. I don't know. Oh, yeah. um, it's it's good to know these things for when spooning. I want to. I like want to know the breeding with which I spoon. Yeah. You know, it should be a good pedigree. I don't think you're that neurotic though. You're you're differently neurotic. You're not. I'm different. I'm quietly neurotic. I seem to be. I come off as very calm. But my head is a total shitstorm. Hmm. It's a total shitstorm. I like make checklists for things to cover with my therapist nice. ahead of time. I'm like, Emily, you are in for a whirlwind of hate today. Just wait. Just sit. Are you sitting? Are first, you sitting? First name though. With oh the, yeah. With the therapist. Oh that's, yeah. That's that's spoon tastic. This is a red bed, which is a lot of pressure for a man. But I, I feel Why? like it's calming for a woman. Why is it a lot of pressure? Well, man, the... do, do you feel like you're a bull? Like, I, are you, are you on? Yes, exactly. <laughs> is, this, is this España? I rage when I see I rage. <laughs> rojo. There's a mood that's set okay. for a man when it's a red or like a pink bed where it's like... Interesting. You have to be extra masculine or it's going to really come across as like pansy or... Okay. Effet, is that a word? Effet. Effet. There we go. Red bed for a girl is like... Romance. I was gonna say if you Sense. have your period, you, oh. won't, you can just go wherever you want. <laughs> <laughs> Spooning with a pregnant woman would probably be. Your arm would get so tired, both of them. I was gonna say fun. What's your favorite kind of ice cream? It's oh, Columbine flavor. Well, and Wolverine is from Canada. Did you know that? I'm not surprised now that I think about it. Yeah. That's that's a fact that I didn't know, but I'm surprised that I didn't know it. So you don't know comic books and you don't know video games. I know what, what kind of woman are you? All right, well, Lucas, thank you so much for coming in. I have so much to think about. I'm going to talk to my focus groups, and we'll get back to you. And talk to Emily. Oh. Your therapist. <laughs> um, you're never going to guess what happened this weekend. I spooned, like, 30 dudes, and I felt so loved and so empowered. Aww. Aww. Well, I feel like this was a dual therapy session. I feel like this is just two Jews spooning. Two Jews spooning? I guess that would mean that they were both spoons intended for matzo balls. Thanks again. Thank you. Oh, it was the best. Oh, we're hugging. Yeah. Okay. And if you did it, if you are on your period, it's okay. You can tell us. I, I'm not. Okay. I'm really not. I, I wouldn't. She's definitely on her period. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Okay, that wasn't fun. <laughs> no, I didn't like that. I didn't like that ending. So we're going to have a better ending. Hi. We never said anything about her period. Yeah. I'm going to go get my Lucas, get the soup. fuck out of here. I'm